Hey guys, Youngblood with you, and I wanted to make a real quick video for the Mag Rider drivers out there. Um, but I wanted to keep it quick for two reasons. One, because it's a really simple thing to do and it doesn't take long to talk about. And two, um, because I'm guessing most people that play and drive a Mag Rider frequently probably have already figured this out. However, there's not a lot of content online talking about this, so I figured I'd at least make this for you VS players, hopefully helping you out a little bit. That being said... Uh, while I was making my anti-air mag rider video, I found out that if you are actually driving your mag rider at an angle, you know, rotate your vehicle about 30 degrees and hold, like let's say you rotate 30 degrees to the right and hold W and A, um, you're then kind of like side strafing while going forward. Um, and basically what happens as a result is um, with no chassis or with racer chassis, you end up picking up about an additional two to three miles per hour or kilometers per hour of speed. Now, if you're using the rival chassis, you actually pick up around five kilometers extra uh, per hour. So it's a significant difference. It's not huge or it's not going to be game breaking. But, um, you know, for example, if you choose the rival chassis and you decide to kind of do the side strafe, it's going to kind of help make up for some of the speed that's lost by not choosing the racer, thus giving you a little bit more versatility. Now, this does come with a specific downside. The fixed gun on the, um, the, fixed gun on the uh, front of the mag rider. Um, you're not facing the direction that you're actually driving it. Now, you can still see over there, especially out of your left peripherals if you're tilted to the right, um, but it's not going to make you combat effective immediately unless you're being smart about your driving. So if you're going a long distance and you know it's relatively clear, probably do the side strafe, um, the forward side angled strafe, whatever you want to call it. Uh, if you've got a shorter distance to go, um, I would probably just drive uh, you know, head first, making sure your guns are on target. So... Uh, apologies if that's redundant. Hopefully it helps at least a couple of people. I didn't know about it considering I didn't play it very frequently either. So um, hopefully that helps. Stay tuned for more and I'll catch you guys later. Take care.